Hey internet and welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. As you can see, no children today, no montages with other people, just gonna be me and you chatting. Today was my last day of work as a graduate assistant at the university. And like so many other times in my life, a chapter of my life is closing and it's always just really interesting when that happens. I mean, by this point I'm used to it happening, I know what goes on, I know how it works, but it's just always so strange. Because in my experience, there is very rarely fanfare. You know, it. you might have a going away party at some point, you might go out to lunch or something, but the moment when it changes, the moment when it ends and you move on, it's like that saying that like the world isn't going to end with a bang but with a whimper. Like, it's just a moment, like any other moment. Like today, I left work like I normally do at five o'clock and got into my car and drove home, and that was it. Like, I'm not gonna go back there. And it's just always a strange feeling because you don't experience that feeling of things are different until, like, the next time when you would be expecting to do that thing, and then you don't do it. So, like, tomorrow... Well, not even tomorrow. I don't normally work tomorrow. So, like, Monday, when I would normally be going to work, and now I'm just not. Yeah, it's... It's a weird thing. Last week you got to meet two of my co-workers, Jasmine and Aaron, and I've done a really poor job of talking about my co-workers on the vlog. And part of it was because I didn't really know how much they would be comfortable with me sharing, but also at the same time it it was a little bit weird for me because, you know, yet again I'm in this new situation and I didn't know anybody and I was becoming friends with them and like when you become friends with someone, there also isn't that point where suddenly, like, you flip that switch and you're friends. Like, it's slowly and it's over time and that's how it worked with these girls and that's how it's worked <laughs> my entire life. Like, friendships build and it's not like suddenly you've gone from acquaintance to friend. You're just, one day you are looking around and you're like, oh yeah, these people, they are my friends. I will say that I did get really lucky with my coworkers, as I've gotten so many times in the past. I can't talk about how many times I have been in a job and just felt so incredibly lucky because the people that I work with are awesome people. They're people that I feel like, you know, we have so many things in common with and I feel like I can talk with and they are hilarious and we just have a good time and it's the same way with these girls. And I really feel like I've done them a disservice on the vlog by talking a lot about how I don't have many friends here, but I really was developing these friendships with these girls and, you know, several of them in particular, like one of them, Erin, who was in that video, I taught a class with. I taught a an online course with and so we got to interact quite a bit and she's just like a joy to be around she's so funny and she's so sweet and same with Jasmine and same with our co-worker Amy and we I don't know I just I've been able to develop different relationships with each girl but all very awesome relationships and it's just you know it's been really nice and I just I feel bad because I haven't talked enough about it. And I haven't really given those friendships kind of the gratitude that they deserve because, like I said, I was really nervous about coming here and they've been awesome. But that weird, like, coworker friendship thing is another thing that goes along with this not with a bang but with a whimper thing. When you leave a job like this or when you change your life in some way like this and you have that last moment. Like it's hard to know when the last moment is that you're ever going to see somebody and while my coworkers and I have a plan to like a meet up next week and we've talked about what we're going to do over the next semester and like try to keep in touch and communicate, like you never know. You never know when that is the last time. There are people that I met in this position, in this job that I had that I will never see again. And that is very bizarre. I had several students that I worked with throughout the semester and like I knew their names and I would see them and say hi and like we were friendly, but I will probably never have a chance to interact with them again. And that's so weird. <sighs> Life is weird. Basically, I'm grateful for the time that I had in this job. It taught me so much. I had a really good time with it. Next semester is definitely going to be different, not getting to go into the university and work with the students and hang out with the other GAs. Like, life goes on and life moves and life changes and I'm glad and it always lets me grow and I have new experiences, but, you know, it's sad. You get this kind of nostalgia feeling knowing that 
like when things were good and they're gonna change and that good thing's not gonna be in your life anymore. Not sad. But anyway, endings are weird. Beginnings are also weird. <laughs> and this particular beginning in my life is going to be kind of weird too because it's not necessarily a beginning, it's just more of an extension, like a more intense extension because I'm going to be in the school full-time, in the high school full-time starting next semester rather than just uh, two days a week or three days a week every other day. So, I don't really know what to ask you guys about this without, like, it being a super downer question. So, I guess just let me know your thoughts. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow.